Nerf Man 101 here with this long awaited gun shadow. Uh, first of all, I'll just like to state a few things. Hopefully, I don't sound too cocky, but honestly, this is the cleanest DTG integration ever. Well, dark tag gun for all of you who don't know what I'm talking about. But oh my gosh it is so clean especially with this paint job it, it sorry boom 13 to talk about you but yours was a little it wasn't clean uh but it was still great and i'm glad you thought of it and uh all credit goes to him and then the other guy nerf haven uh i forgot his name but i'm sorry but a uh, great job as well you used the handles i believe to cover it up and it wasn't uh it didn't. It wasn't that clean, but of course, great job. You went 13. Um, I'm not really including you in this because you singled your long shot, while the other two guys uh, basically, well, you know, you took advantage of the long shot and had the clip and everything. And I respect your option to single it. You know, you get like 100 and whatever feet, but I'd rather have more ammo than more distance. Like I said. Speaking of distance, my gun shoots about 90 now because it's spring compressed. I don't feel like stretching it back out because there's no point. And plus, I think I almost broke the plunger because the spring was so strong. So, yeah. But uh, without further ado, here you go. Okay. Better yet, first I'll show you it, then I'll show you everything else. But here it goes. Shadow. The awesome, awesome gun of awesomeness. It is so cool. Super clip. It's just a very clean paint job. I'm not done yet because I have to do this. And at the actually I'm not gonna do that. It's no point because I have the PVC there to hold it in place, so there's no point. But as you can see I kept that orange. Dude, look at that, it looks so menacing. It is awesome, 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 awesome gun. But anyway, uh, like I said, this this is my cleanest paint job ever. Like, I hate taping when I paint, but it is well worth it. I recommend taping instead of trying to do it very carefully because then you just make mistakes, stupid mistakes to say the least. But uh, here it is in my hands. It is awesome. Got your key ring. Hold up, let me get it around my finger. And then just record everything's there, it's perfect. Just that menacing look in your face. <laughs> and that little dart in the middle. This is amazing. The paint job is clean. The only thing I messed up on is this. I didn't know I didn't I need to paint that, so I'll go over that a little bit later. But, uh, yeah. Put this back in. It is awesome. I love this gun so much. It's just so awesome. Of course, uh, as I stated before, the wire I fired this off of, and then clip, prime, and then just fire. Yeah, you can hear the spring because it's compressed now, but who cares? It still fires about 90 or so. So yeah, uh, I am ready for a war, that's for sure. I just needed to get the one sometime, or just make my own. But, Dude, it's so clean. Just admire that paint job. That's PVC holding it in place. Not much conversation because I'm just admiring my work. So, sorry. Uh, I just finished it and... When I was taking off the tape, I was just like, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I almost cried. <laughs> Cr 
cries, tears, tears. <laughs> but yeah, um, I, I sprayed the paint the super clip. If, if you can tell, it's different paints. I have to repaint the super clip, but and then make another one for the back. But uh, that would be ten. I mean, twelve plus twelve, twenty-four plus the ten in there. So that equals thirty-four shots. And no, I'm not gonna do the one where you sand down around so you can take out the turret and then add another turret because I just don't feel like it and I don't want to risk it actually messing up. It's perfect for me. I don't. I have another uh, DTG in my closet as you just saw. So yeah, uh, I think I'm good. So uh, I'll probably see PVC this old one, the one that I broke. And then if it works, then I'll put it on that one over there. And, oh, there's my recon. And here's another football. Cowboys, that's the team to go for. Except Romo, because Romo stuts. I'm sorry. Romo is a horrible person. He, okay. Yeah, he likes to mess up everything for the Cowboys and, and gets on my nerves. But, anywho, since I'm done with my paint job, I'll put this on. And there It's electrical tape around the grip. Then this is just going to be left orange because it still looks pretty good. So, this is how it's going to look when I use it. And I have to say, the contrast between the orange and black really accents the gun. You know, I'm an artist of sorts. <laughs> But, uh, cleanest integration I've ever seen with the DTG, uh, besides, shoot, I can't remember, I, I'm horrible with usernames, but, uh, someone else did one, and it, the paint job looks just like UN13's, and his is actually really clean, and I like it, I think he see PVC to his dark tag gun too, I'm not sure, I have, I'm sorry if, that I don't know your name. I can't remember it, but, uh, yeah, uh, that's it. This probably will be my new photo for my background because it just looks that good, so, uh, there it is. Shadow, everyone. The most awesome gun ever. And I really like the bat because it actually looks pretty good. There it is, guys. Uh, I'm glad my battery isn't dying. So, cause I just got some crappy batteries out of my closet that I found, and I just put them in my camera. But anyway, that's besides the point. That's Shadow. I hope you really enjoy it because I know I do. So, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. One more awesome look at it. Super clip. Hey, and guess what, guys? You already know who I am, most likely. Nerf Man 101 saying, Sarnar.